I would like to welcome you all to the 2020 ABS Virtual Graduation Ceremony in recognition of the class of 2020. My name is Duncan McMillan, the high school counselor at ABS, and it is my honor to serve as the MC for this very special ceremony. To our class of 2020 and your families and friends, thank you for joining us today for this significant occasion as we honor the achievements of our great students. This ceremony is under the patronage of His Excellency, Mr. Marzouk al Ghanim, President of the Kuwait National Assembly, who has contributed immeasurably to the welfare of the youth of Kuwait. Thank you, sir, for your great contributions to Kuwait and for your support of our students. I'd also like to recognize Professor Faiz al Kharafi, the head of the Board of Trustees, and thank her for her continued support of this graduating class and our school. Finally, to Mrs. Arij al Ghanim and Ms. Jacqueline Shaw, our school directors, we thank you for everything you do for our students in school each day. Your support is unending and your passion for education is inspiring, so we thank you. It is now time to begin our ceremony proceedings, where we have the chance to celebrate the academic achievements of these great young men and women as they reach the end of their high school education and prepare to move on from this place and time into the very brightest of futures as college students, successful professionals, great thinkers, and hopefully wonderful leaders in their communities and world. The end of this year has been different in so many ways. Yet in this time of great uncertainty, our great educational community rose to the challenge of carrying on in the face of hardship. Such a momentous endeavor would not have been possible without the leadership of this class of students. To the class of 2020, you shone in all your pursuits while students at ABS. But most notably, you awed us all at the end with your passionate spirit and resiliency. And for that, we must thank you for your legacy and for inspiring each and every student who comes after you. In this spirit of thankfulness and reflection, we cannot forget to thank the parents, guardians, and families of our graduating students who have loved and encouraged these young men and women throughout their educational journey. Through hardship and success, never ceasing in their commitment to you, students. So I hope that we can join together in our appreciation of these wonderful parents and families who were the rock and foundation of the ABS class of 2020. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Would you please join us in observing the playing of the Kuwait National Anthem? Next, we have Faisal Ahmed, who will be reciting the Quran. Please observe this moment with reverence. <laughs> Thank you, Faisal, for your beautiful recital. 
And now we've reached a very special moment in this ceremony. Please join us in welcoming virtually the outstanding ABS class of 2020.
It is now my pleasure to introduce our honored guest, Mr. Marzouk al Ghanem, President of the Kuwait National Assembly, who has some words to offer our graduating seniors. Benati wa abnai dufat alfein wa ishreen, alf mabrook tacharashkum, farhatna wa farhatkum, la tu saf. للأسف لم نستطع أن نلتقي بكم بشكل مباشر في هذا العام بسبب أزمة كورونا لكن أنا أحس وأتوقع بأنكم دفعة مميزة لذلك كل شيء لكم مميز فاستطعت أن تتغلبوا على هذا التحدي تحدي كورونا وأول من بدأ في التعليم عن بعد واستعمال الأونلاين وهذه تجربة فريدة من نوعها وأيضا هذا تمهيد لانتصاركم على التحديات في المستقبل إن شاء الله بودي كنت أشوفكم أصافحكم فرد فرد وأهنيكم على المجهود الجبار اللي بذلتوه طول سنوات دراستكم لكني كل أمل وثقة بأن تميزكم سيستمر وإنجازاتكم ستزيد وإن شاء الله تلتحقون بأفضل الجامعات ونشوفكم إن شاء الله في أعلى المراتب بما فيها رئاسة مجلس الأمة ويعني عن بعد بالجسم أقول لكم ألف مبروك لكن عن قرب بالمشاعر أقول لكم ألف مبروك إن شاء الله الله يوفقكم Thank you for such an inspirational and supportive message Mr. Marzouk al As we progress further into our ceremony you will now have the chance to hear from members of the ABS management and administration who will be offering their words of encouragement to our students. We will hear from Mrs. Arij al school director, Ms. Amal al Manawi, senior principal, and Mr. Duncan and Ms. Charnett, the high school counselors. During this video, we also honor our students who are leaving behind such a positive impact on our school community. Please enjoy this congratulatory video. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على أشرف المرسلين وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين أعزائي أولياء الأمور أبنائي وبناتي الخريجين والخريجات أسعد الله يومكم نلتقي بكم اليوم لنحتفل بتخريج دفعة جديدة من مدرسة البكالوريا الأمريكية دفعة لها معزة كبيرة في قلبي دفعة لها مكانة كبيرة في نفسي دفعة التحق أغلب طلبتها بالمدرسة منذ إنشائها عام 2006 دفعة آمنوا أولياء أمورهم بقدراتنا وإمكانياتنا فلهم مني جزيل الشكر وعظيم الامتنان ومن التحق بنا فيما بعد فلهم مني كل المحبة والاعتزاز والتقدير فتمنياتي لكم بالتوفيق بإذن الله أبنائي وبناتي الخريجين والخريجات أعلم بأنكم كنتم تتمنون أن تحتفلون بهذه المناسبة بظروف أفضل وبموقع آخر وبأسلوب آخر ولكن قدم الله ما شاء فعل ولنحمد الله سبحانه وتعالى على نعمه التي لا تعد ولا تحصى ولا تقدر بالثمن وهي نعمة الصحة والعافية نعمة الأمن والإيمان نعمة الكويت هذا البلد الطيب من أمتع وأجمل اللحظات عندما أراقب أبنائي وبناتي يخطون خطواتهم يشاركون في أنشطتهم يجنون ثمار جهودهم فأرى نجاحاتهم وأشاركهم أفراحهم وإلى مزيد من التقدم والإنجاز بإذن الله مررنا بظروف صعبة ولا زلنا تحت وطأة هذه الظروف ولكننا خذنا تجربة جميلة وإن كانت صعبة وشاقة إنما كانت مثرية ومثمرة وهي تجربة التعليم عن بعد ولولا همة أبناؤنا وبناتنا ودعم ومساندة أولياء الأمور وجهود أعضاء الهيئة الإدارية والتدريسية لم استطعنا التغلب على السعر فلله الحمد هذه التجربة أدخلت نقلة نوعية في نظام التعليم في مدرسة البكالوريا الأمريكية وجعلتنا أكثر صلابة وقوة في مواجهة التحديات في المستقبل ومواجهة ظروف غير متنبأ أتوجه بالشكر الجزيل لكل أعضاء الهيئة الإدارية والتدريسية ولكل العاملين في مدرسة البكالوريا الأمريكية على دعمهم ومساندهم لأبنائنا الطلبة والطالبات لاستكمال عامهم الدراسي بنجاح. I would like to take this opportunity to thank every and each staff member in all the departments for their tremendous efforts supporting ABS students and making this year a successful year. Your efforts are invaluable. أبنائي وبناتي أدعو الله سبحانه وتعالى أن يوفقكم ويسعدكم ويثبتكم على طاعته وأن أجتمع معاكم عن قريب على الخير والمود أبنائي وبناتي 
الخريجين والخريجات من دفعة عام 2020 اليوم يسعدني أن أبارك لكم تخرجكم هذا فأنتم الدفعة المميزة نعم المميزة التي استطاعت أن تتحدى كل الصعاب كان عاما صعبا ولكن الحمد لله تخطينا كل الصعاب نعم درستم ثابرتم اجتهدتم تعبتم ولكن حققتم النجاح وهذه هي النتيجة تخرجتم وكلنا فخر بكم ما زلت أذكركم عندما كنتم صغارا في الروضة الكثير منكم كان في ABS منذ الطفولة منذ أن كانوا في رياض الأطفال واليوم أنتم شابات وشباب أفتخر بكم الخطوة القادمة هي خطوة أيضا مهمة في حياتكم وهي فترة الالتحاق بالجامعة خطوة تحتاج إلى المزيد من الجهد تحتاج إلى الكثير من الصبر والتركيز كذلك أدعو الله دائما أن يرعاكم أينما كنتم في الكويت أو خارج الكويت عين الله ترعاكم قبل أن أنهي كلامي أيضا مرة ثانية أحب أن أهنئ ذويكم بما قدمتموه من تقدم وتميز أبارك لكم تخرجكم هذا وأدعو لكم دائما بالتوفيق مع تحياتي مس أمال سينير برنسبل Thank you it may be wrong of me as I, as I continue this message to, to highlight groups of students and individuals, but I, I think it would be wrong of me not to mention the students of the National Honor Society during this clip. Um, <clears throat> they're a very special group of people who have done some wonderful work supporting local charities and organisations, and also charities that work around the world, um, both raising funds, joining activities, and increasing the profile of these groups. Amongst the NHS students, I would especially like to mention the presidents and vice presidents over the past two years, Saleh, uh, Khalid, Rehaf, Fajr, Hamid, um, especially for the extra effort they have put in um, to support the work of the National Honor Society. Unfortunately, we also didn't manage to have an induction ceremony for the students involved within NHS this year. Um, so it's just a, a time of being able to remind the NHS students and other students of, of the four pillars of the National Honor Society that I think are four pillars that we should all remember as, as we go through our lives and careers. They are scholarship, um, an understanding to be able to do whatever we do to the best of our ability, leadership, the understanding of guiding others um, to reach their potential. Character, the importance of being seen as people with integrity and honesty, and also an understanding of service. Cheers to you, class of 2020. I want to take this moment to congratulate you on finishing out your senior year and reaching the finish line, despite all the hardships and difficulties that you guys have faced, especially over these past couple of months. I can think back to my first year here as a teacher at ABS, I remember subbing the ninth grade classes that you guys were a part of. We had some challenging moments. I remember even yelling at some of you boys a couple times, but it's been great to see how you guys have matured since those early days as freshmen at school. This year I've witnessed the great care that you guys take, that you show towards each other, towards your families, and towards the school community in general. I've been very proud to be your counselor, to see how you boys have not only matured, but really stepped up to the plate to lead the campus in a positive way and leave behind a strong impact on the school. To the students I've taught over the past few years, thank you guys for being amazing. It's been also a joy teaching you in class. As a whole, the class of 2020 is a really strong class. You guys have so many talents, so many gifts, so many passions, and in general, a great drive to succeed in everything that you do in life. So I really do hope you all the best as you move on from ABS. I hope that you remember our conversations that we've had. I hope you remember all the Nespresso's that you've drank in my office. And I hope that you guys stay in touch with me to keep me in the loop about what you're doing after ABS. So thank you guys and cheers to you again. We are so very proud of you. I have watched you grow. I've witnessed your drive and your resilience these past two years. I've had so much fun being a part of your journey. I remember running from you guys in the hallway because I had to get to a classroom meeting, but you wanted some information. Our bake sales, our field trips, 
um, the times that you can just stop by my office just to talk or say hi. All of those little things really made my day. And I am so grateful that I had the opportunity to really get to know you all. The day that you've been working for is finally here and you are graduates. Um, my last piece of advice for you is very simple. While you continue to work hard to make your families proud, please also make yourselves proud. I want you to enjoy the journey, but I want you to be the best versions of yourselves, even when no one is watching. Now, we don't get to see you walk across the stage, but just know that we are celebrating you, and my heart is with you all. Congratulations again. السلام عليكم معكم اخوكم يوسف العنزي خريج اي بي اس دفعه 2020 بالمناسبه هذه كنت حاب ابارك زملائي على التخرج وذكريات وسنين جميله جدا عشناها وقضيناها مع بعض ونشكر معلمينا ايضا ما ننسى فضلهم ومبروك شباب بالتوفيق We first have the honor of hearing from the ABS class of 2020 valedictorian, a very special student who not only achieved the highest GPA in her class, but who also displayed the highest degree of academic drive and integrity in her years as an ABS student. I introduce to you Lulua Al-Salam. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen. Wa salatu wa salam ala ashraf al-anbiya wa al-mursaleen. وعلى آله وأصحابه أجمعين معالي رئيس مجلس الأمة الموقت السيد مرزوق الغانم رئيس مجلس الأمة الأستاذ الدكتورة فايزة الخرافي مديرة المدرسة الأستاذ أريج الغانم السادة أولياء الأمور إخواني وأخواتي الخليجين والخليجات السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته أود أن أتقدم بجزيل الشكر والامتنان إلى مربيتنا الفاضلة دكتورة فايزة الخرافي فقد أنشأت مدرسة تلقينا فيها العلم بأعلى مستوياته فتوفرت لنا البيئة العلمية والتربوية التي كنا نحتاجها لنصل إلى أعلى مراتب العلم والمعرفة وأتوجه بالشكر إلى مديرة المدرسة الأستاذة أريج الغان على جهودها الخالصة وحرصها الدائم ومساندتها المتواصلة لنا فكانت بمثابة أم ثانية لكل طلابها إخواني وأخواتي الخريجين والخريجات وهنئكم على إكمال مسيرة 12 سنة كانت رحلة صعبة ولكنكم نجحتم في تحويلها إلى درب مملوء بالذكريات السعيدة والصداقات الخالدة وأنا فخورة بإنجازاتنا وتماسكنا حتى في وجه الصعاب فأنتم سبب فخر لأهلكم وجميع من حولكم ولا أستطيع أن أذكر رحلتنا الطويلة دون أن أذكر فضل أمهاتنا وآبائنا فلهم الفضل في كل إنجازاتنا ونجاحاتنا فهم من سهروا الليالي معنا وتعبوا على راحتنا فغرسوا بذورا ورووها لسنين حتى تفتحت وأصبحت أزهارا جميلة يتبعون بها وأتوجه بالشكر نيابة عن زملائي وزميلاتي إلى من لهم الفضل الكبير في نجاحنا معلمين الأجلاء فهم لم يكونوا مجرد مدرسين ومدرسات وإنما كانوا قدوة ومرشدين ومنابعا للعلم هم من جعلوا من المدرسة بيتا ثانيا نجد فيه أسرة أخرى ولعبوا دورا أساسيا في تكويننا ليس فقط كطلاب للعلم وإنما أيضا كأفراد متميزين وأعضاء فعالين في مجتمعنا فهم وأهالينا زرعوا فينا أفضل القيم والمبادئ التي حددت ماضينا وتشكل مستقبلنا إن هذه ليست سوى محطة انتظار فعلينا أن نكمل مسيرتنا وأن لا نتوقف رغم كل الظروف فاستمروا في درب النجاح ولا تتوقفوا حتى تحققوا جميع طموحاتكم وإن حققتموها فاطمحوا بما هو أكبر حتى يصبح كل صعب سهلا وكل مستحيل ممكن والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Thank you for your words, Lalwa. Your commitment to academia is a great model for all students, and we are so very proud of your accomplishments. Lilua plans on studying medicine at Kuwait University, and we wish her the best of luck. We will now hear from another special student, one of the ABS class of 2020 salutatorians, 
a young man whose great commitment to academic excellence earned him the second highest GPA in his class and whose passion for learning inspired others. I introduce to you Fahed Mohammed. Thank you for your message, Fahed. We are very proud of the standards you set for yourself and others and can't wait to see where your passion for learning takes you in life. Fahed will be studying medicine at Virginia Commonwealth University in the United States, likely starting in spring 2021. Good luck to you, Fahed. We now have the honor of hearing from our second salutatorian in the ABS class of 2020, an inspiring young woman whose pursuit of excellence in academia and drive to display the highest integrity in her pursuits helped earn her this great distinction. I introduce to you Reem Al-Babtain. Hello everyone, my name is Reem Al-Babtain and I'm the female solicitor for the class of 2020. I would first like to congratulate my fellow peers for graduating this year despite the difficult circumstances that we were thrust in. I'm sure none of us expected to graduate in this fashion, however, one thing for certain is that we made it to the end of the line and there is no going back. I would also like to extend my gratitude to Ms. Elie, Dr. Manena, and Ms. Aman for their exceptional leadership throughout the entire year and especially during this difficult time. To Mr. Duncan, thank you for always checking up on us and reminding us of Archie Bill's character. To Ms. Shar, thank you for being the best college seminar teacher, as you truly made the whole college application part easier for us. To our teachers, thank you for torturing us with difficult tests and quizzes, but also for all the effort you put into ensuring that we truly understand the material and that we're prepared for college. In ABS, our goals were simple. They included setting part of class of physics, quiz, or dividing the plan to convince a teacher while we reserved to get a few extra points on the test we almost failed. But as seniors and new graduates, our goals changed. Getting into university became our most important goal, and our goals transformed from passing the test to passing our college exam, from getting into clubs such as NHS to getting into universities in the UK and in the US, from writing essays for English to writing essays for college application. Needless to say, this is indicative of the fact that we've matured and accepted responsibility for our future. Personally, I believe that the class of 2020 is a special class. We were the youngest students during the founding of ABS and have witnessed the school transform so greatly. We were there when the uniforms changed from a white shirt to a blue shirt, when the playground was added to the elementary campus, when several of the buildings were remodeled and added, and when we had about five different English teachers back in grade 8. However, I believe that we transformed the most. We're no longer the kids who used to play in the playground back in third grade, nor are we the teenagers who would pass the teachers for higher score on a test who almost won. We're young adults who made it to the finish line only to start the race for our future, but nothing in our future will ever be what we're supposed to do this year with. 
Although we never walked the halls of ADS as students again, the memories we made in the school walked through the halls of our minds for the rest of our lives. We we'll always remember that teacher who impacted us like no other. That teacher that brought the biggest smiles to our faces. The memory of passing the test without we to fail. Most importantly, we we'll always remember the friends we made and lost through this journey. And personally, there are a few friends that I never want to forget. So no matter how lost or certain you may feel about your future, know that the comforting hands of your friends and family will lead you past the doors of ABS to a future that is bright and pleasant. Thank you. Thank you for your words, Reem. Reem plans to study chemical engineering at Kuwait University, and we wish her all the best in these pursuits. Now at this point in the ceremony, it is time to recognize other outstanding students who committed themselves to participation in various extracurricular activities. We begin by recognizing the students who were a part of the prestigious National Honor Society for three years. NHS is a global organization of some of the most academically driven students whose passion for learning, development, and service to their respective communities distinguishes them from their peers. We would like to acknowledge the following students for their commitment to education and to this organization over the past three years. Reem al Babtain, Mezun al Dawek, Taiba al Fayez, Huda al Khalifa, Badria al Marzouk, Fajr Nasrallah, Aisha al Uda, Suad al Rafai, Maha al Rahayez, Bulwa al Salam, Hamid al Sabeh, Jenna al Tabtabai, Salah al Fawaih, Zaina al Yahya, Jenna Madu, and Jasim Ramadan. Congratulations to each of you for this amazing achievement and distinction. The class of 2020 has always been known as an inquisitive one, a group of students who was always on the lookout for new experiences and understandings. Their involvement in our school community went well beyond the classroom, and many in this cohort displayed a commendable commitment to bettering their community. We would now like to take this opportunity to recognize more students whose behavior and involvement in our campus left behind a positive impact and who went that extra mile to give back. We continue in this recognition by recognizing participation in the ABS chapter of Model United Nations, an organization focused on preparing global-minded leaders and thinkers. This year we recognize a student who was involved in this organization for three of her high school years. Please join us in congratulating and thanking Reem al Babtain for this great commitment. Another ABS organization focused on preparing leaders in the respective communities is our high school student council. Tonight, we recognize those students who were involved in this organization for two or three of their high school years. Each of these students have bright futures ahead of them. Please join us in congratulating and thanking Fajr al Nasrallah, Tamim al Tamimi, Mizdun al Dawek, and Abdul Mohsen al Yagut for their great commitment. The class of 2020 is full of leaders, young men and women who stepped into roles this year to lead their class and did so with grace, maturity, and a true care for their peers and broader community. Tonight we recognize four boys and four girls who became the voices and advocates for their class, their community, and who never ceased in their commitment to bettering the educational environment at our school. The four boys we recognize tonight for their excellence in leadership are Fahed Al Rashid, Khaled Al Osemi, Salah Thuwek, and Yusuf Al Ghanim. The four girls we recognize tonight for their excellence in leadership are Badria Al Marzouk, Fajr Al Nasrallah, Mazun Al Dawek, and Taiba Al Fayez. We thank each of you for your great commitment to our school and can't wait to see where your leadership skills take you in life. An important component of education is learning the value of service. Many of our students at ABS are greatly committed to volunteer work and clearly have a passion for it. However, each year there are a select few who go above and beyond this call giving greatly of their time, energy, and talent 
to benefit others. Tonight we recognize a young woman and a young man whose service to their community is nothing short of inspiring. Collectively, these two students logged just over 600 hours of community service throughout their high school years. So tonight, for their excellence in volunteerism, we recognize Aisha al Uda and Khaled al Osemi, and we thank you for your great commitment to service. Our next award is for Model Citizenship, and it was created to recognize students for their everyday good acts. These students are noted for their consistent good behavior, positive attitude, and their willingness to help others. Their good-natured spirit makes them role models for younger students in our ABS community. The young men recognized for their model citizenship are Mohammed al Badr, Abdul Wahab al Atiki, Abdulaziz Abdullah, Abdulaziz al Orefan, Yazan al Zawawi, and Jassim Ramadan. The young women recognized for the model citizenship are Haya al Rashid, Zain al Yahya, Shahad al Alemi, Noor al Duesan, Arwa Abdul Salam, Anwar al Garib, and Basma al Awadi. Thank you for your efforts and commitment. Student athletes are an important group of any student body, and our students at ABS made us all proud Wildcats this year. The class of 2020 has led the way in athletics during their time as students here. And in this ceremony, we have two awards to recognize achievement in athletics. The first award recognizes the best players of the USAC soccer tournament. And the young woman and young man earning this award are Hezer Al Raji and Hamid Al Sabeh. The second award recognizes the overall best sports student of the year. Recognized for their achievement in athletics this year are Lulwa Al Salam and Abdul Wahab Al Ali. Congratulations to each of you. Now that we have pointed out and highlighted individual achievements and various extracurriculars, the time has now come to recognize all of our graduating seniors of the class of 2020. This is the moment each of you have been waiting for and working towards during your entire educational career. You have worked hard and the time has come to see your efforts paying off. Each name of the ABS class of 2020 will now be read. I want to share with you the order in which these names will be read. First, we will recognize the students who are receiving high honors. Next, names will be read for those students receiving honors. And then the names will be read for the rest of the class in alphabetical order, beginning with our female graduates and then switching to our male graduates. Please join us now in honoring these great graduates of the ABS class of 2020. Lul Wan Sa'ad Salim Fahid Nabil Muhammad Reem Abdul Mahsan Al Baqtain Fajr Nail Al Nasrallah Su'ad Mbarak Al Rafa'i عبد العزيز صلاح عبد الله جنى ايمن الطبطبائي بدريه حمد المرزوق شهد علي العليمي مها محمد لرخيس عايشة مشعل العودة جاسم باسل رمضان نور بدر لدويسان وجل مرزوق بدي 
زينة وليد اليحيى حدى ناصر الخليفة رهف سليمان الحربش حمد خالد الصبيح عبد العزيز خالد العريفان خالد عبد العزيز العصيني فهد اسامه الراشد بريق بشار القطري جنى حمد مدوف أروى فايز عبد السلام هاجر جاسم الراجحي طيبة عصام الفايز حور مطر المطيري مزون عبد العزيز لدويخ شاهة وقيان لوقيان خالد سالم الرشيدي عبد الرحمن سامي النفيسي عبد الوهاب طارق العتيجي يوسف أحمد الغانم سارة أحمد الحلبي عبد الرحمن نايف الراشد صالح أسامة لذويخ فوزية حياد الزامل بسمة بسام العوضي دلال أحمد العصيني أنوار سعد الغريب غالية جاسم النوري حنان حمود العنزي هيا جاسم الراشد لطيفة أنور عبد الغفور لولوة طلال العربي مسك طلال اللذينة مضاوي خليفة الخليفة نجلاء حمود روضان نوف باسل الخالد نورية يوسف العمران ريان مرزوق السلطان رزان السيد هشام الرفاعي شيخة خالد المطيري زين صالح رخيص زمر نواف السعيد عبد العزيز مرزوق الغانم عبد الله اياد الحساوي عبد الله ابراهيم الصقعبي عبد المحسن وليد الياقوت عبد الرزاق غازي المضف عبد الوهاب رياض العلي احمد بدر الوقيان احمد ابراهيم ابراهيم احمد نواف المرزوق 
بندر سعد اللافي دخيل احمد العصيني فهد احمد العصيني فيصل عبد الرحمن النمش فيصل فرحان الخالد حمد مشعل السعيد حمود طارق الخرافي حسين علي الدشتي جزاع محمد الصباح خالد مشاري المنصور خالد وائل العدساني محمد علي الخواري محمد خالد البدر محمد أحمد العصيني ناصر بدر الهاجري راشد ناجي الخليفة سعد صلاح الوزان سالم صلاح الفهد تميم أحمد التميمي يزن طلال الزواوي يوسف أحمد العنزي And now to celebrate our new graduates, a special song has been organized. Please join us in joyfully remembering each of our students and their years of hard work.
Once again, congratulations to you, the ABS class of 2020, and may you find happiness and success in your journey ahead. Congratulations again. Congratulations.